this is Dr. Hayek and this video is about acid-base equilibria. In today's topic we will discuss the titration and pH curve of polyprotic acids and bases. Now let me remind you of the outline of this chapter where I will be talking about six different topics so please refer to the corresponding video for the topic of interest. Now let's discuss the titration of a weak polyprotic acid with a strong base. Now an example of polyprotic acid is H2A, so it's a general polyprotic acid and it's diprotic acid which neutralizes in two steps. Now the first step is the H2A will react with the OH- to give HA- plus H2O, so HA- is the conjugate base of H2A and the HA- will also react with the OH- to give the A2- plus water. Now when we plot the pH curve for the titration of this diprotic acid, we find that this diprotic acid has two equivalence points. Now the first one where the pH is equal to 6 and the second where the pH is equal to 11.9. Now also for this diprotic acid we can find that it has two half equivalence points where the pH at the first equivalence point, it's equal to pKa1, which is the uh, coming from the Ka1 for the first dissociation, and the pH of the second half equivalence point is equal to pKa2, which is coming from the Ka2 of the second dissociation. Now let's consider the pH curve for the titration of a 0.1 molar of phosphoric acid with 0.1 molar of sodium hydroxide. So the phosphoric acid will dissociate in three steps and we will end up having Ka1, Ka2, and Ka3. Now if we plot the pH curve of the titration of phosphoric acid and sodium hydroxide, we will get the following points. We plot the curve, the shape will be the following. Now, in here you can see that the phosphoric acid has a three equivalence points uh, where the pH starts from 4.67, then 9.46, and 11.93. We can also see that the uh, pH curve has three half equivalence points, and for each equivalence point, the pH is equal to the corresponding pKa. So the first equivalence point, the pH is equal to pKa1. The second equivalent half equivalence point, the pH is equal to pKa2. And for the third half equivalence point, the pH is equal to pKa3. I hope this video was helpful to you, so please like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.